Only a short time of grace left. Every day takes you closer to the end. And no matter how busily you create and work for your earthly well-being, your concern will be futile, for you will be unable to enjoy the benefits of your efforts, everything you think you can buy will be taken from you again and you will only have few possessions to take with you into the spiritual kingdom when everything is over, because you will only keep the spiritual goods which your soul acquired on earth. But regardless of how often this is said to you, you don't believe in an approaching end and your efforts to attain the possession of this world increase every day and render you incapable of working at improving your soul. Yet were you able to foresee that you only have a short time of grace left, you would be alarmed at how close you are to the end. But earthly life moves on every day, one day goes by like the other and this is precisely what makes you question predictions of this nature. However, from one day to the next everything will change, suddenly you will be confronted by events which will completely disrupt every individual person's life, all of you will be pulled out of your usual composure and be faced with great dangers, you will have to defer your earthly work and plans because you will simply no longer be capable of dealing with them in view of the imminent dangers caused by human will. For nations will rise up against each other and it will only take something minor to burst into flames which will threaten to destroy everything and then people will forget even more what their actual earthly task consists of. But neither will they be able to continue with their work and activity, but instead only try to save themselves and their belongings, thus only consider their physical life and comfort but never their souls. And they will have to recognize that they are powerless in the face of all events which threaten to befall them, they will appeal to people's common sense and goodwill but to no avail. On the human side everything will take its dreaded course, but the divine side will intervene and thereby shatter human plans, nevertheless, people will not be spared what they had anxiously feared. They will suffer the loss of all that which keeps their hearts imprisoned, they will lose everything and will be able to learn to recognize the power of God in a natural event of incredible magnitude. For the scriptures will fulfill themselves, and you human are on the verge of this whether you want to believe it or not. You carelessly only ever create and work for your physical needs and will lose everything. But you do not care to satisfy the needs of your souls. For then you will need not fear anything even in this forthcoming time, because then you will be taken care of by the one whom you have already accepted, otherwise you would not want to consider your soul. For this reason the forthcoming event will be mentioned to you time and again, time and again his words will sound as an admonition and warning and time and again the foolishness and pointlessness of your earthly striving will be brought home to you. You only need to listen to it and arrange your life accordingly, and you would be able to face the coming events calmly and without worry. Don't be too delighted about the apparent calm and the prosperity in an earthly sense, don't stifle your conscience with earthly pleasures. They are only illusions which will quickly fade away, for you humans will watch powerlessly as everything comes upon you and be unable to defend yourselves from it. But it has been announced to you often enough, giving you enough time to consider it and change yourselves. The fact that you failed to do so will have a dreadful effect on you, for God's plan is irrevocably fixed and, as soon as the time has come, it will be implemented, as it has been determined since the beginning. Amen.